Right, generic readings. Um, it's been quite a while since I've done this. Not quite a while, but like, you know, a reasonably long while. Um, last episode gave me a whole lot of trouble on the upload side of things, and I was really kind of reluctant to go back. Well, you know, it, it. I just really hope that I've fixed it, because if I have to go through that again, it was, I mean, like, I had to, I ended up trying to upload the damn thing probably six or seven times, and two of those times, it was, um, hang on, let me turn the sound down a little bit, because it was actually pretty loud last time. Um, like, two of those times it took, I'd say, 18 plus hours to, you know, upload the thing. It was ridiculous. Like, I, I left it going all night and then through the next day, like, twice. Uh, first time it didn't even work. Um, so... I don't know exactly what I did wrong, but I think I've got something that'll work now. We'll see. Um, but anyway, um, away from the technical side of things and back to the Minecraft, because um, I have done a little bit here. As you've probably noticed, I've got some redstone now, which is excellent. Um, and I also got some iron. I got... I don't know, I can't remember how much coal I had, probably a little more. Um, and a bunch of cobble, although, uh, let me, I'm really running out of hunger, and it's kind of bad. I ate one apple, and I've been making wheat, or I've, I've been, I've been growing wheat and eating it basically as fast as it grows, um, and I'm, I might have to expand this farm, because it's just not growing fast enough for me. Oh, that's interesting. Look at that. Servers were down last night. That's why I didn't record then. Um, servers or something. I couldn't connect to Minecraft.net. Everyone was getting an issue, apparently. Um, found a post on Reddit that was complaining about it. And so... Um, and, you know, everything was down. And then I figured, oh, it's fine. I log in. Oh, that's great. It's great. And it would appear that I'm not actually connected. <sighs> oh well, whatever. I'll play with the default skin for now. It's okay. I can get through this. Um, so, it would be a bad idea to head down to my mine. Oh look, some wheat grew. I'll take advantage of that. Do I have any in my chest? I can't remember. Um, I need to remember to speak up. I think I just spoke too quietly there, because... Um... The video does record very quietly, and I just need to remember to keep my voice up so that I can be heard. Um, and it's something I keep telling myself, I've known it from the beginning, and I just forget to do it. Um, so, you know, one way or another. If I had any bones, I already made bone meal out of the one... Nope, I do have another bone. I made bone meal out of one, but apparently not the other. It's actually rather disorienting to have a different skin there. It's bizarre. Sort of surreal. Um, so let's get some wheat going here. Um, as, oh, cool. Awesome. Awesome. Um, do, 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 uh, do. Now let's. Awesome. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. There we go, regen some hearts. Um, now I'll head down into my mine, show you guys what's going on down there. Um, yeah, so I extended this down quite a ways, um, and then hit lava. Like, this was an entire solid pool right here. Um, it was pretty unpleasant. Like, you can see I filled all this in. Um, and messed up in a few places, but we're really close to bedrock, like this is first layer of bedrock right there, and
and so that was a major pain in the neck and I actually wasted probably about as much cobble as I had gotten with the prior digging um, just trying to fill it in without actually just dumping water and making obsidian everywhere which would just get inconvenient later down the road um, and then I started digging this I didn't get that far but this is gonna probably be my main like mine um, I've already gotten like you saw a bit of redstone stuff like that just basic 4x3 to maximize my chances. I'll probably branch off from here too. You know, basic branch mine. Go off like 100, 200 blocks and just make branches off, connect them all up. That kind of thing. That kind of thing. And it should work. Um, maximize my chances and all that and see everything that there is to see. Uh, and so. Um, Let's see, what else? The back up at the surface, I have done a little bit of work on aesthetics and stuff. I didn't do much. I wanted to do most of that on camera um, if I could. Woohoo, watch my hunger bar go down. Every 20 jumps. Can you tell that I just watched the Etho video on hunger? Um, I actually did know the stuff beforehand because I had looked it up because I was curious. Um, that was probably more than 20 jumps, but my saturation meter is pretty much full because I ate bread. Because bread is one of, it, it's at least some of the, one of the sort of reasonably good foods. This coal has been kind of bugging me. I'm going to just harvest it. And oh come on. Ha huh, so I was thinking lately about like the long term game plan for this. Um like where do I wanna eventually go with it? Um and how do I wanna get there? Like I do wanna get to the end, preferably as soon as possible, and I think that's gonna be the primary goal. Um, at least long term. So, um, obviously for that, I'm going to need to get to the end. For that, I will need to get to the nether and get to nether fortress, probably make up some kind of blaze processing thing, if not a fully automatic blaze farm, like, you know, would be ideal. Um, so... I'll probably be doing that at some point, but of course in order to get to the nether I also need diamonds, so I'm going to need to do a bunch of mining, get myself a pick, then dump probably a little more water around and collect the obsidian down there, um, assuming I don't find more, and I want to clean up that area anyway, so, you know, um, but yeah of course just short just one short of yeah that makes sense there we go yeah one one short of a nice no oh, I already have I have coal it's all set um so yeah I'm hoping to find some abandoned mine shafts that'll be cool get myself the melons that I'm eventually going to really want Melons are just cool, um, and I love building melon farms. Um, I've also been working with um, like mob processing um, centers. Like I, or yeah, like I want to make a big spawning tower sort of thing. Um, and this isn't just because I'm. It's just, it is not just because I'm going to go out inside and do something so that I'm not being completely unproductive while I'm talking. Um, I'll harvest wood. That's always good. Um, I should have grabbed myself an axe. Probably do that in a sec. Um, yeah, where was I? Uh, I want to make a mob um, spawning area connected to, like, 
I haven't quite decided yet whether I'm going to make it XP based or, um, you know, traditional fall damage based, uh, or maybe drowning based, but that's a little slow. Um, I prefer to just, you know, drop them and get it, get it done with. Um, I might make it toggleable so that you can, like, turn on a water break and then punch them. And, like, it gets them down to nearly dead, and then you're able to mm, finish them off so that they're completely dead. And, you know, have that result in XP. Um, I might be able to get it down to one punch that way. I'm really not sure. I'm not using any pistons or anything anywhere else, so I can probably get away with it. Um, I've got, like, a, yeah, I got a design going in creative that seems like it'll work. Um, it's pretty cool. I figured it out. It's, like, 36 spawning spots per level, and each individual tower is, like, 15 by... It's 15 by 15, I believe. Um, you know what? I'm going to head out here and collect some cocoa beans. I think that it's... Yeah, the sun is setting. Darn it. Okay. I'll need to get back inside. Um, but... I hope I find a jungle temple, too, at some point. That would be cool. Yeah. Awesome. Um, I better get myself some jungle wood so that I have something to plant that stuff on. May as well just go up to the top of this one, I guess. Uh, just as soon as I finish with this, I'm going to get annihilated by mobs who don't like my face for some reason. Because it is nighttime. It is rapidly approaching nighttime. But once I have a reliable mob system of some kind um, that will potentially be XP and at least be a source of gunpowder and a source of, um, you know, that kind of thing, arrows, um, depending on how I make it, like bows and armor even, um, depending on how efficient it is, I don't know, we'll see, um, eh, oh god, it's nighttime, yep, okay, here we go, Let's see if I make it, oh, there's already a creeper over there, um, he's guarding the entrance to my hole, I guess, no, nope, that's not the entrance to my hole, it's not glowing, hi, archer, don't mind me, don't mind me, nothing for you to mind me about at all. And boom, there we go, safe. Excellent, um, and there's my other wheat. Excellent, brilliant, brilliant. Um, I think that's the three wheat I need for another bread, so I'll have a little backup here. That's great. And I actually don't remember how to make cookies. Like, I've never made cookies because it's been so absurd to, um, but now I kind of want to, just because, you know, it's kind of neat. And yes, I will be making a better farm than this, um, and I don't like that. That looks horrible. Um, I will be making a better cocoa bean farm thing than this. Just like I'll be making a better um, sugarcane farm than the one I have over there. It's just a bunch of sugarcane um, planted on the side of a lake, a little miniature lake thing. May as well put them there and there. Yeah. There we go. Isn't that pretty? It looks odd. It looks very odd. But okay, um, yeah, I'll be making a better one with pistons and stuff later on, um, once I have the resources and the ability. But I think I am going to prioritize the mob unit, uh, the, the, um, mob system. Um, so the first thing I need is a large space. I'm going to have four 15 by 15 um, cylinders basically 
Um, and that works out to be 29 by 29 because I can merge like the walls. It's like a 29 by 29 space and I want to have I think four levels works out to be 20 high. So this is going to be a big area. This is going to be a really big area. That's 36 spawning spots per level plus um, uh, yeah, 36 spawning spots per level times uh, four levels on each cylinder times four again. So no, it's just kidding. It's not. It's not. Um, it's not 36. Uh, I said, I said 36. No, I meant um, 40. It was. It was 36, but I've since figured out how to make it 40. Um, in a relatively reasonable and compact. Darn it. Of course. Of course. I'll grab an axe too while I'm at it. Actually. Um. And. So. I have already gone over the limit that I was shooting for. Um, I just lost track of time there. Um, I was oh, that was smooth, wasn't it? Look at that. That was that was just excellent. Um, I was going to shoot for um, just fifteen minutes for this video, but that's already not happened. Uh, the thing is, um, we've started up a new Microsoft Labs bulk channel, um, which is all well and good, uh, but it doesn't have the ability to upload over 15 minutes, which is kind of the point. So we were going to figure out, um, we were, we were going to try and put up some videos that were um, shorter to hopefully get to the point where we could um, upload the longer videos uh, we did not think that one through at all it's you know but it's what it is and we'll hopefully get it working eventually but we need something to post there in the meantime I guess um, so I was gonna try and start making my videos 15 minutes um, which would be good for me as well I guess because the way I'm doing this like I'm not cutting or anything because I don't want to have to edit. Um, it just adds, it adds too much to the process, and like I wouldn't get episodes out nearly as often. Um, I might eventually start doing this, especially if the series really takes off. But at least for now, I'm just not going to, because otherwise it wouldn't happen. Um, and so I don't think I'm gonna grow them on the sides again. That looks. That looks terrible. Um, I keep wandering by things, losing my train of thought, and then... What was I talking about? Hi, skeleton. Don't mind me. Um, yeah, so it might actually be better to do um, shorter episodes just... So that, you know, I can do a little bit, then do a bunch off camera, then show you guys where I'm at, do a little more, do a bunch off camera, that kind of thing. Uh, because at this point, it's looking like I just need to go mining, like, a lot. Um, that was probably going to entail blowing through a whole bunch of resources and grabbing a bunch more and blowing through more resources and so on. I'll try and keep it as boring as I can. Um... You know, just, you know, harvest wood, make wood into picks with iron that I also get, or stone. I might switch to iron picks solidly. Like, I haven't in the past, but I might just, like, at least until I come up with, like, un until I get, um, until I get low, or until I actually... Oh, I forgot about that. That's cool. Get experience now for cooking stuff. Um. Yeah. That's something I need to work on. Just losing my train of thought. 
I've done it like seven times this episode. It's horrible. Okay, well, anyway, um, I get distracted so easily. It's horrible. Absolutely terrible. So anyway, I might ep end the episode around here um, instead of making it a bit longer, and I'll try and get another one up really soon. Um, after I've done some basic boring mining um, and stuff, I'll probably be eating from my farm, and I'll also, while I'm at it, I'll probably just look up how to make cookies, because I want to make some just for the heck of it, and see if it would be worth it, because that would be a good watermelon equivalent for me at this stage of the game. Um, I think if they like use wheat and maybe sugar, like I can do that. So, um, I need to get an indoor reed farm going. Oh, I don't know if I mentioned I put an infinite water spring here. Toted some water back from the, um, well. Um, and by well I mean, I may as well show you guys where I planted the sugar cane and shit. Um, there have been a few additional creeper explosions around here. I don't know if... All of them were caught on camera. I think one at least wasn't. Um, another one blew up over here. Um, there were two, and I led one over to the water, feeling really cocky. Um, he he fell in, blew up. It was like everything was safe. I was able to get far enough away that I didn't even get hurt. Nothing blew up. Like no, nothing was destroyed. Um, and then there was another one, so I said, hey, I'll just dispose of him in the same way. And he blew up just before getting into the water. Nearly destroyed all my sugar cane. Uh, made me hunt for more. But thankfully, he didn't quite. So I was able to replant, and it's actually a little bigger now. So, um, And a little more level in here, so I'll just count that as creeper giving me advice on my aesthetics. Yeah. Oh, 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 okay. Yep, that was, yep. Yep, that's, that's terrifying. That, that freaked me out right there. That's a problem with this particular update. Um, I was talking with Artemis earlier, like, this is an absurdly buggy update. Like, a lot of cool features, don't get me wrong, and I'm very happy about it, but at the same time, like, this is just so buggy. So many bugs all over the place. Um, and specifically, you know, ones like that one, where if a water current is pushing you up against a wall, you can actually sort of half clip inside it. I don't know. I don't know how it exactly works, but like the game recognizes you as being inside the stone like inside the wall and you'll actually take suffocation damage from that um and it's kind of inconvenient and more than a little bit terrifying uh, <laughs> I hope they fix that soon um and there are a few other things uh but that's the big one the relevant one right now anyway um, yeah. Guys on the ends aren't even growing. Come on, I want you to grow so I can get rid of you. You look horrible. So, anyway, um, I guess, um, I'll actually end the episode around here, um, as opposed to ending it four minutes ago. Um, and... I'll get back to you guys when I get back to you. Hopefully this will be an easier upload and everything will be straightened out there. If this has taken an absurdly long time to reach you guys, then it's probably been another pain in the neck. We'll see. And if those kinds of things continue, I might not even continue the series because like it was, oh my god, it was a nightmare. Anyway. So, I guess that's that. Um, and I will be back with you guys whenever I'm back.